Is it on? See that little red light's gone. I reckon it is. All right. Yeah. Well, today's the day we here celebrate the day of Martin Luther King Jr. Excuse me. Reverend Martin Luther King Jr. That means that it's a holiday and folks got to take off work and stay home. A lot of folks is bitching about that, but you know what? A lot of you are the same ones that wanted him dead in the first place. So, if he wasn't dead, you wouldn't have the holiday. So it sounds like you kind of shot yourself in the foot as well as him. But anyway, if you don't want to take the holiday, you ain't got to stay home. Just go down to the plant and have the guard let you in. And you sit the, sit the shift for eight hours. You ain't going to get paid, but ain't, you ain't taking no holiday neither. Now, you know, I'm forcing a gun to your head. Folks, life ain't got to be so hard if you use a little bit of brains. All right? Now, another thing. Folks are going to go around quoting him and saying his words and stuff like, I got a dream, and judging by content of your character and not your, not your sunburn or whatever. Well, look, you can't say them words. And no, it ain't because you ain't allowed to have no dreams. Well, dreams is what makes you human and stuff and all that. And it's, being American, you're supposed to have dreams and stuff. Hell, I got dreams sometimes, and they scare the shit out of me. But look here. You can't say them words. That ain't what it's meaning. Okay? Let me break it down for you, no nuts. Them words is copyrighted. That means you want to go around saying them words today, well, then you got to pay the King family. It don't make no difference that old Dr. King went down there to Washington and stood in front of a million folks and said them words, because he copyrighted them words. That's right. Them words is registered. You can't just say them words. I mean, you can have whatever dreams your meth-induced hallucinations can take, but I mean, you know, just because it's floating between your ears don't mean you get to say it, because it's his words. All right? And them King folks, they don't come cheap. You gotta pay him the big bucks if you wanna go around quoting an old doctor. That's right. Now, Alcatel, they paid him I don't know how much put put his words on TV. You think he's gonna afford that? Well, hell, that even goes one better than old Jesus. All the best they can do for him is just put his words in red in the Bible. Man, think think what happened every time you gotta pay the church every when you whenever you wanna quote scripture. Man, I'm telling you what. They won't need to pass no plate around. But then, of course, wouldn't nobody know the words of Jesus anyhow because ain't nobody got no money like that to pay to quote Jesus. That might have been a good thing. I don't know. Anyway, just a couple of thoughts I'm going to pass along to you as you celebrate this day because, you know, it's a big holiday and everyone gets to take it off. But like I said, you ain't got it. Get your, get your ass out of bed and go down there and sit for eight hours. And that's right. Tell them, tell them you... Tell them you you, you ain't going to celebrate nothing like you do. You don't believe in And I had a that old woman come up to me and tell me, it's a shame we don't celebrate Robert E. Lee's birthday anymore. Well, that's on the 15th. And I said, well, that's some kind of hell, ain't it? You lose the same Civil War twice. What, what can you do? Anyhow, that's about it. About what I got to say. I guess that's done. I got to wait for that thing to shut off. Or is it shut off? What, I got to get up and turn it off? Well, hell. All right. Well, that's about it. Y'all folks have a good MLK day. Don't do nothing I wouldn't do. Well, that little button right there? How about that? Hell, wait a minute. I got a fart.